Okay, another day. Another new Battlefield 5 gun from the summer update. We're playing with the Shoshar today, which, in my opinion, is one of the the better new weapons. What are you doing hiding in the purple flowers over there? Let's see if I can get this guy. Use it as a DMR, basically. But yeah, this is one of the better weapons from the update, in my opinion. Hang on a minute. Take a little bit of cover. I'm determined to get this guy. Determined. You know I'm going to push along the back, see if we can get him. Definitely one of the better weapons from the update. Oh. Is he dead? I think he might now be dead. Yes. We got him. No more attacking C for you, my friend. But yes, this is the Shoshar. It is a extremely slow-firing, cumbersome, heavy-hitting light machine gun. And I've been really enjoying it so far. Offer something very different than what's uh, currently available in uh, in Battlefield 5. And obviously I love this thing in Battlefield 1, so it's kind of a bit of a throwback. But it, it is it is good fun to use. Is that uh was that a German soldier that came through the door? I think it uh, well, it might have been. <laughs> I kinda lost track. <laughs> oh, that's one thing where the Shoshar can really help you. Sometimes you get yourself caught out. The high bullet damage, it can it can save you. Quite, it's, it saved me quite a few times already. Someone over here. Got him. Oh, someone right behind me! It's a Japanese soldier on a European battlefield. How very Battlefield 5. So I have got the Shoshar unlocked to rank 4. And um, through the choices, I opted to reduce the uh, horizontal recoil and um, reduce the amount of time it takes to reload. Because this is a heavy monster, this thing. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? And having a slightly faster reload time is definitely going to help you. We were getting a little bit pinned down in the town, so come out to uh, help capture E. It looks like it'll be captured by the time I get there, which is not a problem. But... Um, in fact, I should probably get off the tractor to talk about this bit. Because <laughs> uh, I kind of need to be talking about the uh, the Shoshar. But as you can see, I've still not got off the tractor yet. The Shoshar does bounce around a little bit. And um, it takes a long time to reload. So they're probably two good options for you. But, I mean, it does have rather a large presence on the screen as well. It takes up a little bit of room. And uh, the reload is, is, is not brilliant, honestly, it's not. It does take a long time. And the reduced recoil speed is only by 15%, so it's not a huge change. But it's, it's better than nothing. And it can get you out of a jam in sort of like mid to close range fight. There's a... there's a... there's a... Bang. But we're ruined. See if we can get this guy running up on us. Yeah, we can get that guy. Oh, there's someone over the other side of the bridge. There he is. Shot right in the back. Oh, why did you stand right in front of me? <laughs> Completely lost track of that player. Your average Battlefield player, ladies and gentlemen. Standing in front of other people. Right, just got to stay hidden here for a minute. Kind of in a difficult position. Yeah, we are in a bit of a difficult position. Let me just mark C because we need to hold on to it. Screw this. wonder if that will get him. Now I'm being attacked from this side. Oh, we did get him in the end. <laughs> you can see what I mean about the recoil. It's um, pretty bouncy. Oh, we're getting a res. Beautiful. We've got to hold on to C. One of the tiger tanks is down that was annoying us. There were two over there. Over on this field. Oh! Okay. The Shoshar is so slow to start firing. Turn around and even to hit fire and the bullet hadn't even come out of the barrel. And that MG42 had fired about 30 right at me. Oh, they're coming in. That's one. Come on, 1911. Do your thing. There we go. And get me out of a close range jam. We're just above the B capture point here. And, uh, unfortunately, the Germans are taking it a little bit. Just trying to cause a bit of a distraction. It was a good takedown. 
Took a lot of damage, though. Have to hang around at the back. And they're going to def they're definitely going to push up. It's time to move back a little bit. Okay, they're right there. Got him. Is that the tractor that's been destroyed down there? That is the tractor that's been destroyed over there. I wonder if we can jump over, get a better angle. There is a lot of explosions going on right now. Got your ammo. Is that on the... Yeah, on the bridge. <laughs> I think he was shooting me earlier, actually. Cheeky lad. Cheeky World War II lad. Wow, they're actually holding this really well right now. Can I take that guy? I'm going to have to res you. You've been resing me all game, so I want to make sure I return the favour. You can see how powerful, though, the Shoshar is at mid-range. Is that someone shooting us? Yeah. Use it as a DMR. Look at that. Come on. Headshot. Oh, he's going to hide now. Right, okay. I'm in a bit of a situation now. Come on. Peek. Yeah, we got him. <laughs> DMR Shoshar. It's the RSC. <laughs> I think they were made by the same uh, weapons manufacturer. Oh, I've got nearly enough for a V1. That sound is reminding me of that. Oh, no. Oh, you got lucky. I managed to get one bullet and the second wouldn't hit. Okay, our team were just completely unaware that you're there. <laughs> Still running around. I'm going to have to V1 them back. I've got no choice. And it's going to have to be like right there. We've got to try and push them out. Right. Let's see what this uh, this V1 can do. Because we need to take B back. Here it comes. Boom. Four kills. Lots of destruction. Push up on B now, men. Push up now. We have to take it. Oh, there's lots of people around. If you can kill the medics, they can't revive people. Keep taking down the medics. <laughs> Another V1. Hello. <laughs> this should now mean that we can take it. That will have uh, hit people at the back of the objective. Oh, man, it's just get around the corner. I've got to stay in here. There's too many explosions. <laughs> This is insane. This is absolutely insane. There we go. Oh, I wish I could revive you, but I can't. Oh, this three times optic ruins you at close range, but anything beyond that. It's just flaming people up. Right, let's see if we can take back the C point. Shouldn't be able to get me. Hello. You're not going to fire that off today, are you? There we go. <laughs> I love it. This thing is so good. It's like the new standard of LMG. It's completely different from anything else, I think. Slow firing, heavy damage, high recoil, but you get a good rewarding feeling when you use it. I will be honest, my team hasn't been the strongest this round. Um, I have 35 kills and the closest... Well, the guy's got 48 and 2. In terms of uh, general balance, this has not been great. It actually highlights how bad Battlefield 5's balance still is to this day. It was supposed to be a team balancer with the final update, but it didn't arrive. And apparently it's going to arrive in another final final update. <laughs> it's the final final of all final updates. This guy, Jesse Jacks here, been re reviving me all game. What a legend that guy is. I'm just going to try and push up on this guy here in the tunnel. Ah, that shows you the uh, the terrible hit fire that the show shot has. <laughs> he valiantly tried to revive me one more time. But there you go. That's the show, Shah. You should be using it. It's great fun. As long as you can control the vertical recoil, because that is a bit difficult. But, um, but thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you.